Hey everyone, it's attorney Bianca Jordan from brazenlegal.com. Thanks so much for watching this video. Please be sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the next one. Today's video is just to provide a really quick update on what's going on with the public charge rule. As of the date of this video, August 7th, 2020, the public charge rule is currently on hold nationwide. And that is despite there were a variety of case decisions this week um, different courts are trying to decide different things. None of that affects the injunction that was placed last week on the public charge rule. So as of August 7th, as of the time of this video, on August 7th, 2020, the public charge rule is currently suspended. So that means if you are applying for something that would um, make you subject to the public charge rule, for example, you are someone who has TPS, and you're trying to adjust your status to get a green card through your U.S. citizen spouse, then you would have been subject to the new implementation of the public charge rule. But because of the injunction, you currently are not. So that means if you are trying to apply for a green card right now, you do not have to comply with the 2020 version of the public charge rule. So that means that you don't have to submit all that extra information, the application process should be a little bit easier for you because you don't have to submit the additional information. But we do not know for how long this injunction will last because there are so many different courts saying so many different things. I would not be surprised if this does not end up at the Supreme Court. But for right now, if you were thinking about applying for a green card, I would strongly encourage you to do so as soon as you can because the public charge rule is currently suspended, so you don't have to deal with all the complicated aspects of a green card case that you would if the public charge rule were still in effect. And also, as a reminder, the filing fees are going to go up on October 2nd, which will be here before you know it. So the current filing fee, if you're applying for adjustment of status, is $1,760. October 2nd, that's going to jump up $1,100. So you definitely want to make sure that you can get that application in now, while it's easier and while it's less expensive, I would be more than happy to help you with your immigration case. You can visit brazenlegal.com slash green cards to learn more about the process and to get started. And please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit that bell so that you know when the next video comes out. Thanks for watching.